Alright, in this video we are comparing two emerald cuts. The one on the left is a 1.30i color VS2 clarity. The one on the right is a 1.32i color VS1 clarity, so very similar. And both of these are performing extremely well under fluorescent lighting that you'll see right here at this angle. Very bright bellies across and the one on the right has a little bit more light return on the north and south ends which is always a plus but either one of these are really great performers and at the single I have them right now that's really where you're gonna see how the light return would add up to its adjacent ACIT a set images that I will be sending you. So if you've seen some videos of ours with showing emeralds, you'll know they're not the easiest to capture under film. For example, right now you can see how they're going very dark across the middle. Actually, I take that back. They're doing great. Which is rare. We are happy. But yeah, you have the facets flickering on and off to the ones next to each other. Which will create a very lively emerald cut. Alright, we're gonna move on to LED lighting. Okay, we have these under LED lighting where you're gonna see more of the fire colored light versus the white light return. And the one on the right right now is stealing the show. But, if I angle the one on the left, there we go. So you have these beautiful beams of light going across the diamond. Yeah, both of these are extraordinary. It's just catching them at the right angle. And then we're going to move on to intense spotlighting. Alright, under the lighting we have the strong spotlighting. Uh, it's basically imitating direct sunlight and how it would perform on a sunny day. And again, on the left we have a 130 IVS2. On the right, we have a 132 IBS one, and the main difference between these two is the one on the left, it's a 1.51 to 1 ratio, and the one on the right is a 1.57 to 1 ratio. So, leaning towards the more elongated emeralds, especially the one on the right, and the one on the left is a little bit more of that classic ratio that we do prefer, but if they have slightly more elongated fingers, the 132 on the right would accentuate that. Alright, and then we're just going to move on to natural daylight near the window. Go online and look at it. Alright, on the sliding, we are seeing them in natural daylight and excuse the prongs reflecting into the stone just a reflection and excuse any background noise it is crazy time here all right so do you think is Irene in the office now? 
Both of them, though, are performing great. It's going to be a tough call. Which one is my favorite? Have Irene check to see if there should be a, a book for uh, carpet samples, paint samples, and like a little chain of like cold sample samples. Like but I do think I know which one is my ultimate favorite. But I will not share that yet. All right. Hope you enjoyed. And have a great day. Thank you.